Good day, viewers. You are welcome to the Lord TV, your number one fantastic reality TV that gives you all that it takes to be enlightened on trending news, such as politics, entertainment, sports, and what have you. If you are new on this channel, kindly click on the subscribe button as well as the already subscribed. So please don't forget to drop your comments anytime I drop new videos. Thank you. Ciao, ciao. Trending news. Okorocha won't into feuding in his son-in-law into contesting as a governor. Dr. Ezekiel Izuogu, a brilliant electrical engineer and inventor, designed and developed the Z600 first African indigenous manufactured car. The chieftain of the All Progressive Congress, APC, told Sunday, son, that he joined the party because of the promise of President Momo Puari to stamp out corruption if voted into office, saying that looking back now, more job need to be done to do away with the Malays. Izuogu also made a case for an Igbo presidency in 2023, just as he expressed disappointment on how successive regime in the country have treated technology with condescension. He also gave an insight into the governance in his state. Imo except. Let's start from your state, Imo, and the allegation that the governor, Emeka Ehiodora, is witch hunting his predecessor, Rochas Okorocha. I think Ehiodora means well, in my humble opinion. I think he wants to do well in Imo state and also think he needs the cooperation of the immediate past governor. Rochas Okorocha, whether Rochas is in a position oriented to give that cooperation, I cannot exactly say. If there were wrong things he did during his eight years and the present government wants to do a correction of that, he should not take it as a fight. I was in the APC with Rochas for those eight years and he never confided in me the things he was doing. As a well Wisha, I met him sometime and asked him why he was bringing his son-in-law to be the governor when he is a man on the seat. He said after all Mbakwe's son ran for the governorship race, I told him but that was not during Mbakwe's time. His son never came up to contest during his father's time. I told him that if he thinks that his son-in-law is promising that he should allow him to wait for some time after he must have left office then he can come on his own if the boy is running now the meaning that will be read into it is that he want to plant him in the state after his tenure it also means you want him to defend his interest in some of the things he did as a governor. I told him clearly in Abuja, have a rethink on the issue. He told me he will give it a thought. That incident is one and a half years ago. What thought did he give to my advice? If not to mobilize resources to finance his election, you can see how all ended. Thank you for listening to this news. Viewers, please don't forget, your comments concerning this news are very much important. Please don't forget to leave your comments behind. Click on the subscription buttons as well as bell buttons to receive more updates. Thank you.